Scorpio, Scorpio, welcome back to the channel, Scorpio. It's always a blessing to have you right back here. Today's reading is for you. Please know that if the reading does not resonate to your present situation, please do not get hurt, offended, or in your feelings. It only simply means today that the reading is not for you. However, if you come back another day, guess what? That one just might be. Also, if it's your first time here and you have not subscribed to the channel, Scorpio, please go ahead and hit that subscribe for me. And turn the post notification on so that way you will always be the first to be notified each and every single time that I upload brand new contents. Also, please give the videos a thumbs up because once you thumbs up the videos, YouTube will see that you like the video, Scorpio, and they will push those videos out into a much wider audience. The channel will grow, the video will grow. For all my returning seekers, please know that I love you guys so, so, so much. Thank you for the love and for the support that you show. I do see the love, y'all, because some of you might think I don't see the love, but I do. I do see the love, and I am appreciating every single last bit of that good old-fashioned love. So, happy, 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 happy Thursday. Okay, happy Thursday, y'all. Okay, please make a note that the card has been shuffled and the card has been blessed. Uh, ever before I get into your reading, a prayer is a must. Um, and so we'll just get into a prayer. And then we'll just get into your reading. Let me clear the energy first, y'all. Let's clear the energy a little bit in here. Do a little bit of cleansing here, okay? Hold on, Scorpio. Let's do a little bit of cleansing here. Uh, let's clear the energy here. Okay, my darlings. Heavenly Father, as I go along my day, I ask that you bless myself and my seekers. Heavenly Father, please send on your most powerful angels to take charge over this reading. Using my body as a vessel. Giving me the right words and the right messages that you want me to share with the seekers. Only for the ones that needs to know. Every Father, I give you all the honor, and I give you all the praises. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. Okay, darling. We're just going to go ahead. Um, this is your full reading, okay, Scorpio? I'm just going to go ahead and just pull some messages for you first, and then we're just going to use a tarot, okay? So, angels, let's get into Scorpio's energy, please. Scorpio, please know that this is a general reading. It may go in the reverse. It may also go for one of my cross-watchers who are watching, um, because it's a general one, um, just take it, whatever comes to you, whatever resonate, let it resonate, whatever does not, just leave it at the back door, okay? And I will come and pick it up. All right. I am taking personal readings because some of you just need a personal reading, all right? So I am taking personal readings. So you want to go ahead and connect with me. The information will be in the description part of this video, okay? You will need to make an appointment, y'all. Because I have been getting some calls that wants me to just drop everything right now to do a personal reading. And I cannot do that because I do have other people that have made their appointments. And um, sometimes I do need a break, y'all. Okay, I have to gather my strength. So um, I just cannot drop what I'm doing to do your readings right away, okay? So you have to make an appointment first. Okay, angels. Scorpio, Scorpio, what is that you need me to share with Scorpio, please? Let me have uh, four cards, please. Four cards, please, for Scorpio. Okay. Three cards, please, for Scorpio. Two cards, please, for Scorpio. One more card for Scorpio, please. Thank you, angels. All right, let's get into your reading, my darlings. Let's see what angels wants you to know here. Okay, angels are saying that you need joy in your life, Scorpio. You're saying that you need joy in your life. It's time that you just drop everything and retreat. Retreat meaning just go away sometime. Just move away if you have to. You have to take time out for yourself because joy is what you need. And for some of you, you're not getting that joy that you might be given. Right? They just are saying that you have to retreat, okay? 
So I'm going to need, need, some, need a little vacation somewhere. I need to exhale. Maybe you're feeling too trapped in the situation that you are in. Darkness is kind of falling. It's time to retreat and go where the sunlight is, is what they're saying. Yep, I do see negativity coming towards you. Negative issue. People coming to you with their baggage, with their burden, with their stress. I do see anger. There's a lot of anger that is coming in around you, okay? Anger. Someone wants to take your power. Someone wants to take your power here, Scorpio. Don't allow this person to take your power. They're very threatened by you because I see growth coming towards you, okay? I see you taking a leap, all right, of faith here to your destiny. These people are afraid that you are going to be very successful. And so they're showing a lot of anger towards you for you to be distracted. Do not allow this to happen, is what angels are saying here, okay? Let me go ahead and pull from the tarot here and see what angels are saying here. What are the messages here for Scorpio, please? Angels, what is the message for Scorpio? What are the messages for Scorpio, please? What's the message for Scorpio here? Okay, angels. Angels wasn't wasting any time for you. They are not playing today. No, they're not. Okay. All right, so this is what's going on here, Scorpio. I'm feeling like it's time that you free yourself, okay? Because you do need joy. And it did say that you need to retreat, all right? Go away if you have to. Free yourself. You need some, a wake-up call. It's time that you free yourself, honey. Letting go of the situation because it's binding you and killing your life source, okay? Just let go of the situation because it's not going to help you from being all stressed out. Because I see you, you've been very stressed, okay? Fulfillment is what you need. Success is what you need. I do see a relationship of some sort that is coming through right now. And it's also showing up in your lover's card here being in the reverse. Now, I'm feeling here in the six of wands here, okay, that is showing up. Your relationship kind of feels to me like a power couple type of a relationship. But why am I getting that you need to free yourself? Why am I getting that you need to let go? Letting go of a retreat. You're stressed out because I feel like your person is starting to stress you out. Because a lover's card did come up here. I do feel like... Hmm. I feel like that your person might have walked away. I feel like your person might have walked away, Scorpio. Because I see you feeling very hurt here. Feeling very, very, very hurt here in the lover's card. The lover's card being in the reverse, I feel like you was hurt. Your person is not there. But your, but your relationship felt like a power couple kind of a relationship. Hmm. Let's see what's going on here. Let's see what's really going on here. Angels, let me have some clarity here, please. For Scorpio, please. Let me have some clarity here, please, angels, for Scorpio. Clarity is what I need for Scorpio, please. I feel like Scorpio needs some clarity here. What are the messages for Scorpio, please? Okay. 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 All right. Thank you, angels. I appreciate that. All right. So this is what's going on here. Take it what take what comes to you, okay? Take what comes to you. But I'm gonna tell you what's going on here. Now I'm getting the moon card in the reverse, and it's letting me know that there might have been some kind of a secret that was revealed. All right. I feel like right now, because of that secret that was revealed, I'm feeling like that you're having trouble sleeping right now. Very, very, very restless you're you're having. You've been shadowed right now. Let's just say that. You've been shadow, okay? I do see danger. Danger for this kind of a feeling. You're not sleeping very well. It's very dangerous, okay? Now, please know this. In the world card, all right, I'm feeling, because I'm getting the, the moon card here in the reverse, and I'm also getting the, the world card here be in the reverse. There's definitely a delay on your relationship. 
There's definitely a delay here. And not only is there a delay on your relationship, but I do feel some kind of a hesitation coming in. And I feel like your person is the one who's definitely giving that hesitation because I did see them leaving here in the lover's card here, okay? In the reverse. Now, I do feel like they might have left with a lack of closure here. It was just a false start is what I'm feeling here. But your relationship feels very incomplete here. Very incomplete is what I'm feeling here. Like, like you would go to school and the, and the teacher would give you some homework. And it's, or, uh, let's say they would give you uh, uh, some kind of a quiz or some kind of a uh, test. And you give them, give them that the time is up and then you'll give them that test half done. That's the kind of feeling that I'm having from your person here walking out on you, okay? Half-ass work. Incomplete. False start, okay? They started off really fast, but they didn't finish what they started, didn't they? All right, now, I'm getting the Ace of Cups here, okay? And the Ace of Cups is telling me that your relationship is coming through here, okay? It's time for healing. Healing grace and joy is what angels are saying. Follow your intuition, honey, because this person is definitely not giving you any affection right now, and affection is what you need. Your relationship is calling for peace and love. You're definitely feeling overwhelmed or an overwhelming feeling right now. Very emotion, emotional, all right? I do feel like it's time for forgiveness, okay? It's time for forgiveness is what I'm seeing here in the Ace of Cups here, okay? It's what I'm feeling for these three cards. Definitely forgiveness. Definitely forgiveness. Remember your second card did say you need to retreat, right? Take some time for yourself. Now... I do feel like you have definitely been a victim um, mentally. I do feel like you have a feeling sometimes, Scorpio, like you want to give up. But I don't want you to give up on yourself. Joy is what you need. Joy is what you need here. Joy is what you need here. Retreat is what you need here, okay? Is what I'm feeling here. Now, also know this. Also know this. In the Eight of Swords, being as it came to me in the reverse, I do feel like you're seeing some kind of a problem that has arisen with your relationship. But just know this. This problem that you are feeling, the one that has you feeling like broken, that you have to let go from, know that where there is none, it doesn't exist, okay? It is time that you stop trying to figure things out with your person because you're going to have yourself beat up and burnt out. Victim of mental abuse. In the Eight of Swords here being in the reverse, okay? Free yourself from that. Free yourself. It's time that you free yourself and stop trying to Put pieces together where there's none, okay? This is what angels are saying for most of you, Scorpio. It is time, and the time starts now. That is your reading for today. I hope it did resonate with you. If it did, please let me know. I'm going to go ahead and do your bonus reading right after this one, okay? So make sure you stick around for your bonus reading. Um, just know that prayer works all the time, okay? I say, listen, I'm going to say prayer works every single time because it does. It does, y'all. It does. It does. Pray, pray, pray. Pray, pray. When you pray, no evil spells can come on you. No witchcraft. No none of that shit, okay? No bad relationships. No no karmic. No nothing. When you pray, honey, all that shit is gone. So pray. You hear me? That is how I remove blockage from my life. Just by praying. And watch the enemy fall at my feet. Pray, okay? Because what goes around comes around. When people do wickedness to you, it goes around back to their ass. So just pray that shit back to them, okay? That's how I do it. All right, my darlings, don't forget to pray as I said. And always remember to seek first and you will always find.